The program that we provide for these girls is so life-changing. You know, it allows young women who've come from tragic backgrounds, abusive backgrounds, to um, survive and thrive. You know, we, they are provided an opportunity to learn, to heal, and to experience unconditional love. There is not another organization that I have come in contact with that is anything as comprehensive as our program. Healthcare, medical, dental, optometry, orthodonture if needed. The most important is therapy. Because of the background that they come from, it's really, really important that they can heal their past and develop confidence for their future. Pathways has changed my life in the way that they show me that people really do and love, can love and care about you. My mentor has been there for me, right by my side, helping to keep me accountable with school and with everything else that Pathways wants us to do. And she's been like a good friend to me, but she's also been like a mother figure to me also. I fall a lot <laughs> and there are people there to lift me up. It feels like I'm very supported and uh, encouraged to do my best at everything. It's the most incredible experience anyone could ever be a part of. It's really a part of something. It isn't a thing. You know, it's a living, breathing organization of people, you know. Uh, it's phenomenal. I feel that Pathways to Independence is important to this community because I feel that young women have a lot of different directions that they can go and this provides like a light at the end of the tunnel. Our clients have come from such challenging backgrounds. I grew up in a very um, poor household. At some point, I was kind of neglected. I was homeless. I was unable to get on my feet. I wasn't stable. Um, I didn't have any financial support. I grew up in a family of 10 children, and it was very dysfunctional and abusive. I was abused as a child pretty much my whole life by family members and by other people. Homeless, living in my car. Alcoholic history myself, in addition to drug addiction and an eating disorder. The girls have a chance at life that they wouldn't have had without Pathways help. What Pathways has done for me is it's given me a foundation. It's given me a roof over my head. It's given me um, a place, it's given me a place to be a part of. It's also given me um, an opportunity to go to school and to actually do something with myself where I wasn't going anywhere before. Pathways has really helped these young women learn how to become independent, make smart decisions, and be productive members of the society. When a young woman goes through the program, they have been given such huge um, amounts of time and, and energy and support and love, they want to give back. Because it, the ultimate think globally, act locally, it is changing the greater Long Beach and the Orange County areas for the better. If we take one drug user, one alcoholic, one very abused victim and turn, take them off the street and instead put back an educated, contributing young woman, then the world is better. They go out into the community different people, more productive, more independent, and more likely to influence other people along their ways. It is amazing to me to watch young women who have been crushed uh, find the strength and the courage and the power within to stand tall and really discover their magnificence. Most of our students, probably 95% of them, are, receive a bachelor's degree. Each of the girls have come from such severe abuse, and once they've graduated from Pathways, their lives are just transformed. And when you put the two together, how awful it was and how good it is, that is incredible. Um, for me, that's the best feedback because I'm getting to see her life change and transform so positively right before my eyes. 
I'm currently going to Cal State Long Beach and I'm studying to be a sociologist as well as a teacher. I am studying uh, to become an astrophysicist. I am studying to be a uh, management in respiratory care. I am studying psychology as my major and um, possibly minoring in either Spanish or something to do with the law. My long-term goal is to go into the FBI as a behavioral analysis. I don't know, with me being a biology major and me wanting to be a scientist and do research, I've just done a lot with school and I know I wouldn't have been able to do it without Pathways. The joy I find from seeing them s succeed and move on with their lives. We have many girls that have gotten married and had children and they're so grateful that they can have a family that is in a safe neighborhood and loving family and that their children are going to grow up and, and live without abuse. It means so much to me. My hope for Pathways in the future is that it's sustainable decades into the future and that we can expand to other areas because every community needs a Pathways to Independence. There's women in need everywhere and not just women in need, but women who want help, who want to contribute, who want to make their lives better and exponentially make the world better. There's so many women, young women, that have been abused that could use the kind of support that we give, the comprehensive therapy and mentoring and education. And I hope that you will take this moment to make that impact on um, Pathways to Independence and contribute tonight. I just would hope that you could find it in your hearts to make a, a contribution to the girls because it makes such a big difference. We welcome you to open your eyes and your hearts to supporting Pathways in any way that you can. Thank you all for coming tonight and thank you so much for your support. Thank you for attending the fundraiser and for supporting Pathways. I really appreciate it. The expansion of our life is just limitless at this point and it's because of you because of what you are providing to us thank you so much thank you